so as you all know from my previous videos there are loads of new accessories and they all look amazing I'm actually wearing some of them right now and so there are also of course lots of outfit hacks to go with it so I thought you'd show you all some of them and so the first one is actually from Night Barbie the creator of Rare High and she posted this tweet and if you look in the tweet closely if you look in the picture you can see she is wearing these heels except they don't seem to have all the heel bits on them as you can see on the on the heels I'm wearing they like have tights on them and then it goes up just above the knees and then it has the ribbons but on Night Barbie's heels there does not appear to be any tights on them and so this hack I wouldn't know about if it wasn't for this tweet by if sugar and this hack I wouldn't have known about if it wasn't for this tweet by Ip Sugar, so credit to her. But anyways, if you come to dress up, you go to outfits, you come to your heels, and you get the first colour, not the second one. I mean, I'll show you it with the second one, but it, it doesn't work. Oh wait, no, it is the second. Wait, I found the first colour. <laughs> Now I'm so confused, but yeah, if you do it with the first colour then, I guess, it doesn't work because, you know, it's a bit obvious. Oh, actually though, that does look cool, I like that. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, if you come and you select the heels, and then you put the first colour as whatever colour you want it to be, and then the second colour is your skin tone, that is exactly what Night Barbie has did, and just look at that, that looks absolutely amazing, it makes the heels look a whole new kind of stunning <laughs> and apparently you can actually get heels with that sort of ribbon thing on the top I haven't seen anything like that before but I don't know maybe some of you guys have <laughs> but anyway so let's just go and move on to the next tag so the next one is actually by another member of the Rare High team which is Suki Meki she posted this tweet saying am I kawaii enough and if you go and look at the picture closely, you can see she has the diddly party bow with the bunny ears. And this honestly looks so cute. Suki Meki, how did you make this up? <laughs> it honestly looks so amazing. I mean, Suki Meki did make both of those accessories. Actually, she may have not made the bunny ears, but she definitely made the dear dolly headband. And anyways, let's just go. Do we need to take anything off? No, we don't. Let's just go and, um, what's it called? Dear dolly, there we go. <laughs> And so here it is, a party bow. Let's get it to match the rest of my outfit in black and white. There we go, that looks so cute. And so then if we go remove that, and um, how, do you, how do you spell bunny? <laughs> okay, there we go, bunny is, and then we can have it in black and white. Oh my gosh, these look so cute, I love them. <laughs> These honestly look the best ever. I love them so, so much. Wait, am I wearing something else that I'm not meant to? Oh, it's because the bow goes on one side. Yeah, I was thinking it looked a bit weird on one side. But yeah, that's just because of the bow. I am going to change my hair though a bit, just to like a short style. You know, so we can give it all of the detention it deserves. Okay, no, maybe we should just take it off completely. <laughs> or maybe we should make it a brighter colour, that could also help. Let's just go and put it on some random orange. Does that work? Okay, no, that's still too dark. I want to be able to see it properly. Okay, there we go. Now we can see what is the bed ban and what isn't. This honestly looks so cute though. And I'm pretty sure there will be a lot more outfit hacks with this party bow. Maybe there's not any at the moment, but I'm pretty sure there definitely will be. But anyways, now we have another hack. This one is by Queen Majesty 14. That's a strange name. And so she came up with three different hacks. So let's just go try on all of them. We need to take off our bag for them. Here we go. And so the first one is the Frosted Donut and Elegant Sleeves. Okay. So Elegant Sleeves. Let's just... Oh. <laughs> we need to remove the other stuff first. Okay, here we go. Elegant Sleeves. And here they are. And so it seems like you can have them in whatever colours you want. So I'm going to get in black and white. And then she has the frosted donut floaties, the ones that go on your arms. Um, how, how, how do you spell? <laughs> I can't spell. Oh, oh gosh, I, I really can't spell. <laughs> Okay, there we go, donut. Okay, and then you can have that in whatever colours you want as well. And then it makes some really cute sleeves. If they actually load in. 
Okay, these actually look so cool. Let's just take off some of these accessories that are in the way though first. Okay, um, is that everything? No, the corset as well. There we go. Oh my gosh, especially with this top. This honestly looks so cool. And so yeah, there is a little bit of a gap. You can see your elbow a bit too much for it to be completely together. But if you get the right angle, it definitely does look like that. There you go. Does that look like it's together or what? I think it definitely does. Although maybe you should change the colour of the accessories. Like just have them in complete black with the first and second colours. Let's just go and see what that looks like. If you get the donut and then black as well. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> this honestly looks so cool. It looks like you have some seriously poofy sleeves by your arms. Except I keep on swinging them from side to side. Can I stop doing that? Will the pageant laugh pose help? No, it doesn't, but it does look amazing. <laughs> oh my gosh, this looks so cute. I definitely call this a success, whether we can see our elbows or not. This looks so cute and adorable. <laughs> but anyways, now we have the second one, which is the bear ears and the angeloid ears. And okay, I need to take my headband off then, sadly. I love that headband so much though. <laughs> And so if we get the Leah Ash bear ears, here they are, and we just get them in black to match the rest. And then we get the Angeloid earrings, Ain Jewel, here we go. And then we get that on in black as well. Oh, oh, I really, really like this one. Just look at that. That totally looks together. This is literally one of the coolest life hacks ever. Look at us. We look so amazing. I am just going to change my hair back to normal though now. <laughs> Okay, there we go, a more normal looking colour. That looks amazing. This girl is a slaying sister. <laughs> but anyways, now let's just go and put on the final hack, which is the Sunday hat with the same ears. Not ears, are they ears? I don't think so. What are they actually called? I don't even know. Android hair clips, they're hair clips, not ears. <laughs> But anyways, if we go and get on the Sunday best hat, if I can search it up, there we go. And here it is, you just get that on in black. And okay, wait, I need to take off the other accessory. Which one is it? The bear is. We don't want the bear is. Okay, there we go. Oh, okay, that looks cool. I'm just going to change the colour of it slightly, just to make it like stand out a bit more. If we go and put the first colour of that to white and then the first colour of a Sunday best hat to white as well. Just look at that. That honestly looks so cool. So it's like the wings are coming out from either side. You can see a little bit under on these sides. So I think this is better with like a bigger hairstyle. So let's just go and change it. Which one? That kind of works. That kind of hides it. That one comes out way too much over the top. I think we're going to stick with that one. <laughs> oh, the class angel works as well though. Okay, no. You know what? I want class angel. That looks amazing. I love it so much. I think I'm just going to go and reverse the colours though with the black and white just to make it look even better honestly though these life hacks with all these new accessories they look so cool i love them all <laughs> i mean I, I am literally completely in love with outfit hacks and look at that there we go we look amazing so now let's go and move on to some more life hacks because we haven't had enough yet <laughs> So this hack is from Lizzie the RH saying to combine the Nom Nom frosted arm floaties with the ruffly sleeves and the corset. And so let's go and get our floaties out. Maybe we should just go and scroll this time. <laughs> okay, where are the floaties? Here they are. And then we just get that on in black and white. And then you get on the ruffly sleeves and the corset. Where is my corset? I am lost. <laughs> I can't find my way around my own inventory. This is a bit sad, but okay. We need that and then the ruffly sleeves. I'm guessing that's to put together the little gap that there is, which will be really good. Okay, there we go. Put that on. And I guess that would work with the other life hack as well, saying to combine the like, saying to combine the elegant sleeves with the donut arms. You could also add on the ruffly sleeves. But okay, um, maybe we should take off our hat. Because <laughs> right now, I can't really tell what is what. Maybe we should take off our hair as well. That works. <laughs> okay, actually, wait. Let me take off. Okay, that actually helps. <laughs> okay, there we go. And look at that. 
Okay, I really, really like these sleeves. They look amazing. There is a bit of gap that I'm not liking. I wish these sleeves went all the way around. I'm not the biggest fan of the ruffly sleeves, but I do have to say it looks amazing from the top with this life hack. Is there anywhere, is there any other sleeves though that look similar, but like not the same? I mean, we could try the princess ones. I don't think that's gonna work though. <laughs> Um, um, what, what on earth is going on here? <laughs> okay, no, do not do it with the princess poofy sleeves. That does not work. That looks terrible. <laughs> that looks so weird. Okay, let's just get back on the ruffly ones. Remove the princess ones. And there we go. Now we're back to looking amazing. <laughs> so now we have a hack from Riley FI2484474. Sing to combine the nom 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 arm floats to match your shirt colour and to have short sleeves on the top that you're wearing. And then you get some really cool 3D sleeves. Okay. So I'm guessing this is going to look kind of similar to the one with the like elegant sleeves, except you know, a little bit different, of course. And so if we go and get rid of the elegant sleeves, we get on the donuts and we get them on in complete black this time. And if we just go and put our hair so it's a bit shorter so we can see the hack better and so now we need to go and look for a top okay here we go black not white just black <laughs> and okay where's a good short top um none of these seem to be short <laughs> okay so i'm looking i don't seem to be able to find any short sleeve things any long sleeve things not short sleeved i don't know why you can't find anything so now i'm looking wait actually there's probably some stuff in a normal summer section that's like normal sleeved isn't there <laughs> okay there we go go to style and let's just keep on looking the thing is i wanted something in black to match my outfit but apparently that's not gonna happen okay so I finally managed to find a top that was like the right length and it is a fourth of july one <laughs> and it's not fourth of july right now so it's not really with the theme but you know what that's fine we also need to take off our roughly sleeves and let's just go and change up these ribbon heels just to make them you know matching the season and then of course we're going to get the second color on in our skin tone and there we go Ooh, okay these sleeves actually look really cool you can kind of see the donut pattern because i mean it is white <laughs> not black so then it's like the donuts don't like the donuts and the sprinkles aren't really hidden but you know what this looks really cool i love it it is a little bit too poofy for my liking but you know what the poofier the better <laughs> so now we have one from mx s i c v x v e s it's a bit of a weird name but okay <laughs> And so she says to combine the kawaii sickness with the superhero mask and that this will be really good for the pageant theme incognito. And so I have actually not did the pageant that much. I've only did it three times. Two of the times it, I didn't do it properly. I was like recording role plays or whatever. And one of them was neon hair? Neon? I don't know. I think it was just neon. And the other one was misunderstood. And then the one that I actually did do properly was Valentine's. And I didn't win that. That was very sad. <laughs> oh no. Hopefully I get my first win soon though. But anyways, let's just go and get on both of these. And so if we get it on in black and black, I feel like I've seen this before from someone else, but this is the tweet I got, so this is the one we're using. <laughs> okay, and so if we go and get on the kawaii sickness as well, oh my, um, um, hmm, I'm, um, hmm. <laughs> The thing is, it's not like covering it properly, and that looks a little bit weird. Is there any hairstyle that makes it look better? Oh, 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 that's dark. <laughs> okay, I really like that now. Also, there is a makeup look that literally just makes your whole face look black. And we and where is it? I can't find it. This, this is going to be a bit of time scrolling through. <laughs> Okay, so I can't seem to be able to find the makeup look I was looking for, but you know what, it's fine because we have a hack that can do what I'm trying to do for us. So if we go and, wait, that's not the right eyes, is it? We're looking for the natural girls ones with the like lashes down and then you go and you get the eyeshadow in black. And okay, that doesn't completely cover your face, but yeah, your face looks always completely black. That looks a bit creepy, to be honest. 
But anyways, let's just go and, um, yeah, maybe change our hair a bit. <laughs> just so that we can see what is the mask and what isn't. So if we also take out the sneaky bandit, I don't know. The thing is, you can see your chin, which I really don't like. So I want to add in the sneaky bandit. But at the same time, the sneaky bandit drags down a bit as well. So it's kind of just like, how do you do this? <laughs> okay, no, you know what? We're going to go without the sneaky bandit and just look... <laughs> So out our eyes and then take a look at how it looks. Um, oh, oh gosh, this one's so creepy. Oh, now we have no eyes. <laughs> um, can we have some eyes, please? Oh, okay, that looks really adorable. Those eyes look so cute. And look at this. I kind of like it, but at the same time, it looks a little bit weird because it's not covering up like the whole chin area of your face and it's coming out at the sides. But I don't know, maybe it's meant to look like that. <laughs> But yeah, I think this would definitely look good in that pageant theme incognito, so I totally recommend you use it if you had that pageant theme, and hopefully you win. Good luck for me. Okay, so the next hat is by the same person as the last one, and it says that you look like you're sitting on top of the donut floaty if you use the pose at Sitch Hill. So of course we've got to try that out. First of all, we need the donut frosty, whatever it's called. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I can't say anything right now. Okay, there we go. Donut floaty for the waist, and then we get that on in black and black. Oh, whatever colour you want. Okay, no, you know what? We're going for some nice colours now. We're going to have it in pink and purple. That looks great. <laughs> and we're also going to remove this mask because I don't like it anymore. Okay, there we go. Remove the super mask, the kawaii sickness. Oh, look at that. Look how cute she is. She looks so happy. <laughs> Okay, but anyways, let's just go over to the water now, and where is the sit chill pose? This is going to take me forever to find, isn't it? Okay, so I found it. It's near, like, all the other sit ones, and it's, like, kind of halfway through the poses, so it's not too far. Oh, we're also doing a pageant less still, I just realised. But yeah, as you can see right now, we're just kind of looking normal, but then when you go and do the sit chill... Um, we're under the water. I heard, though, that the donut floaty is meant to make you float. I don't know, maybe that only applies for Sunset Island. So we are going to try that and see if that makes a difference. Okay, so here we are arriving in Sunset Island. Please do not lag me out. Um, my hair's gone. Okay, no, it's back. <laughs> And I'm having a little bit of lag, but you know what? That's okay. And so, yeah, as you can see, you can float on the water when you have the donut frosty on. I do not why it's being so laggy and it's like making me jump up and down so much. It's a little bit weird, but I mean, okay, maybe when we go and do the pose, that will make it a bit better. But yeah, if you just go and scroll to sit chill and you do that. Oh, okay, it makes you go a little bit underwater, which I'm not liking. But other than that, this really works. That looks so cool. It literally looks like you're just sitting on your donut frosty. Okay, wait, c can we get out of the water a bit and just poke our feet in? Not completely, just slightly. So then it looks like we're in the water, but we're not actually in the water. Just look at that. That looks so amazing. It literally looks like you're floating on the donut. It literally looks like you're sitting on the donut frosty. Like you are literally sitting inside of it. <laughs> That is so cool. 10 out of 10, this hack. My favourite, by far. <laughs> but anyways, I think that is the end of the video. Um, Yeah, it's still doing that weird thing. <laughs> I think I'm going to take off my donut frosty. I don't like it making me float. Also, I'm pretty sure you just float normally. Yeah, you do. It doesn't matter whether you're wearing the floaty or not. You just float no matter what. Although, when you're not wearing the floaty, apparently you float to your head, not to your waist. So, yeah. Oh, wait, no, that's probably because of sitting. <laughs> Yeah, if you stand up, you can see your head bobs up out of the water, no matter what, whether you're wearing the floaty or not. But it actually doesn't make a difference. Now I'm thinking, wait. So yeah, even when you're wearing the frosty, um, it still kind of goes to your head. Seeing as you just kind of do this weird jumpy thing, and then you're better off now. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, it, okay, so it seems like whenever you wear the donut frosty, it just makes you do that weird thing. You just go bounce up and down. That's probably something that just needs to be fixed, but you know what? It's fine. <laughs> but anyways, make sure you ring the bell to be notified. You like and subscribe, and thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. Yeah.